Hey there, it's Ben the Coin Geek at Old Pueblo Coin, and today I want to talk to you a little bit about one of the questions we get most frequently in the coin shop is, how much are candlesticks worth? You see these candlesticks, and they come in different shapes and sizes and whatnot, and so you try to figure out, well, how much silver is in one of these because it says it's weighted. And anytime you see something that says it's weighted, so usually that'll be candlesticks, it'll be salt and pepper shakers, sometimes you'll see other things along those lines, you're going to have a whole lot of material in there that's not actually silver. So this is over 80 grams of silver as it is, but if you look at that, at the normal silver price, you know, that is currently something like $40 in silver, and yet the question becomes one of, well, what is actually underneath here, and how much silver do you really have? And so I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like. So with these guys, oftentimes you can peel off the center portion, the bottom portion. So this whole bottom part will start to come off. And see how thin that is? A little piece of silver there. And this piece of silver weighs nine and a half grams. So, you know, that's worth about four or five bucks there. And inside here is a clay. <laughs> this is it falling out there. I'm making a mess here, but this is for just for teaching, right? So this thing here, once I get most of the clay out, and I still have a big clay chunk in the center here, you know, you still have 54 grams listed, but this is still full, full of clay up here. And sometimes it'll have more of a powdery substance in the middle, like uh, concrete. But if you get them out nicely, and take good care of them, this is what it looks like. This is the resin that an entire thing, entire candlestick was made out of. You can see just the way it looks just like a candlestick, only it's resin. This is over 300 grams, and yet it probably only had 20 grams of silver in it. So really, it probably, even though it looks like it's a lot of silver, it really only has maybe five to ten dollars in silver in it, and that happens lots of times with candlesticks. So anytime you get a weighted piece of silver, you don't have a lot of silver in there. You usually have a lot of weighted in there. All right, guys, I'm Ben the Coin Geek. Thanks for watching.